Hey everybody, it's Party Elite with another episode of my Skarsnik Let's Play. And uh, we've got ourselves into a bit of a situation here just as a recap of what's been going on. Skarsnik has been running a bit of a marathon actually. Um, we started off, uh, where we start off? Up, uh, up in this general area here. And there we go, Karak Asgaraz. And we've been traveling straight towards home. Uh, we did hold for a very short while Karak Angazar. But uh, that was taken by Clan Angrund relatively quickly. Now here we are at Barak Var, and for those of you that don't remember, we actually confederated with the Bloody Spears. And they are rebelling right now, which is a little unfortunate because I thought we were friends, but I'm going to have to show them who's the greenest and the meanest. And uh, apart from that though, we got ourselves a pretty decent tract of land. Uh, we've got Mount Gunbad, we've got Mount Squighorn, the Pillars of Grungni, Karagdron, Varenka Hills, and Barak Var, meaning uh, Karaza Karak is actually a very likely target right now. It doesn't have, it's got a decent garrison, but if I have them besieged, I can actually uh, whittle them down relatively easily. Unfortunately, the dwarves did uh, confederate with Zufbar, so just before I could destroy them, they managed to, uh, to spread, uh, giving me a bit more work to do. We'll just leave it at that. So, with all that said, let's take a look at our current situation here. I do have a second army going over here, Nubzub Gore Spitter. Uh, I want him to have sort of a garrison role. I want to hold Barakvar and Varanka Hills. And uh, garrison's not all that great, especially when we've got armies like this coming in from Clan Angrund. So, I just need to be a little careful about that. Um, I do also want to upgrade this army here, Skarsnik's own, get him some more uh, nasty skulkers, perhaps. And at the same time, I've got Nashrak's army here, which definitely needs some upgrades if I want to uh, hit up Karaz Akarak. In fact, uh, Fine. now let's let this upgrade first. Uh, where is our good friend here, the Gobbin de North? Can't embed him this turn, but that's okay. That is okay. Uh, all right, all right, all right. Also, we've got our Wa going already, which is great. Ogak Dribblechin, love that name. Let's see, let's, uh, let's set the target. I know I've got uh, this army here set right now. Um, I guess I could scare them off, but they just come back next turn. Let's hit these guys up. Let's scare these guys off, because of course these guys, they take their turn right after mine. Let's frighten off these dwarfs so I don't lose Varenka Hills. I've got some upgrades going. I don't want them to get interrupted. And we'll just hope that he doesn't uh, decide to get involved in a little brawl here uh, but that will be this turn let's see what happens so yeah those guys should be there we go scared off not a problem oh no oh okay oh we should be fine here might lose pretty heavily that's the only thing I I'd be concerned about Skarsen's got a big army uh, shifty beard taker <laughs> it's got a big oh, decent army the garrison's relatively small, but we do have some magic this time around. Hmm. Yeah, we should be good. Let's do this. Let's hold back Belagurn Fierskir. Alright, so it looks like we're starting off with a pretty big battle. I've got over 3,000 coming in on my side of the field alone. I meant to click gamble there, but you know what? Mistakes were made. Um, Alright, so I've got over 3,000 coming in on my side. Of course, we are going to be able to sandwich the dwarfs. I wouldn't be surprised if they deploy on this hilltop. Uh, I will say, if you see a little stutter at one point in this video, it's because I'm probably changing my graphics settings. Unfortunately, as good as a GTX 970 is, it does have its limitations. I do need to upgrade that. I know I've been saying it for a little while. It's going to hold off until Black Friday, but I might just skip out on that. <laughs> So let's see, I'm, I'm predicting a deployment up here, and uh, ideally I'll be able to actually draw them down into this pit, fire on them with my archers as they come down, and then push in from over top of the hill. Uh, we'll see how this plays out though. Let's see how this plays out. Unfortunately, again, I didn't gamble. Let's say it's for the better. Gambling is bad anyways. So let's get this started. Oh, that's surprising. It's not what I would have expected at all. All right, let's try and get off to the side here as quickly as possible. Skarsnik is my number one. Nubzub is my number two. All 
Alright. Gotta try and keep things organized here. Alright, let's try and meet them on the hill then, if they're not taking it for themselves. Uh, what else have we got? Alright. Alright. Do need to be careful about the uh, hammerers. They are threatening. And also, a lot of my units aren't at full health. Not being at full health, that will be a problem, of course. We could get a decent surround going, actually. Let's get these archers over here. We've got decent range. Might be able to fold in on the enemy as they push in. We've gotta keep coming faster. <laughs> I wouldn't mind forming up over here, actually. Alright. Let's get these guys off to the side here. And let's pull Airy to Stunty Baita off to the side here. Need to be careful of that ranged fire as well, though. It is going to start very, very soon. Keep these guys away. Come on. Trying to scare some of these quarters off right away, nice and early. Oh boy. Alright, alright, alright. Pull back, alright. This is going to be interesting. Oh, lost a bit of ground there. Alright. Sandwich them in. Let's get Spidey in there. Get these guys going back. Let's try to loop around here. What have we got going on here? Come on. Whoa. Some work going on here, and nub zub. There we go. That's a decent cast. We can actually get these guys in here as well. Okay. We can hold them, and we can loop in from the back there. That'll get me a good surround. I need Scarsnake to get in there. Not really helping their charges. Come on. I need Scarsnake in there against him. Pull these guys around. Get these horlers occupied. Or rangers, I guess. And let's get that surround going as well. Come on, dive in there. Alright, alright, alright. Massive army. We're okay. We're good. We've got this. Gotta make sure these guys stay alive. Very easy to lose them. Still got a couple seconds there. Where is Skarsnik? What are you up to, buddy? I need you out. And I actually need these guys to pull back and open fire into these guys. Such a large army. Alright, come on. Okay, so far, where is Spidey? There's Spidey. Let's pull Spidey in here just to get rid of this engagement as quickly as possible. I've got range fire coming in. I should be able to cap it off pretty quickly. Alright, let's keep these guys in reserve just to keep them alive. Let's actually pull these guys in from down there. Uh, where do I need this most? Let's drop it in here. Ah, I just missed. Okay. Let's pull these guys into this conflict here. Again, just keeping some units in reserve, always a good idea. Because then you have, you know, decently healthy units. You actually can go over here now. Took too long to get down here, but that's okay. It ended up working out. All right, let's open fire on these guys. Again, a little bit of that lag. I Sorry, guys, about that. Let's 
Uh, okay. You know what? We should be fine. Where is, uh... Let's pull these guys back. Let's keep them alive. Spy's gotta do a fair amount of work there, but that's okay. Actually, let's go up there. Let's intercept these guys, because they're still at decent health. Let's keep these guys alive. Fire from here. Alright, alright, alright. Let's see. Let's keep these guys. Actually, let's withdraw them. I don't want to pull them into fighting by mistake again. That will be a problem. Open fire. And I'm losing this left flank here. Come on, Skarsnik. Faster. Spidey, let's get you in here. Gotta stop some of this uh, trickle fire from coming in. Put these guys up top. Again, just trying to cut off some of this firing gonna cause me trouble otherwise. And if I can get Skarsnik in there, we should be fine. These guys are retreating. Okay, I've lost that flank. If I can hold it off for long enough, we should be fine. It's not gonna help. Let's get these guys over here. Open some fire there. These guys are off the field. Excellent. Again, I just want to withdraw them because I don't want to pull them into a fight by mistake. I don't want my lack of attention to catch me off guard and have them die. Let's pull these guys away. Let's see if they can make it. That's got another way. Alright, get a full charge here. Let's hold these guys in place. What have we got going on here? Come on. Stunty Baida. Need you. Need you down here. This is where you're going to be most useful right now. I need them to break down there. Let's push these guys up. Let's pull these guys back. Let's try to keep them alive. I'm going to have to merge my army quite a bit after this. Okay, it's fine. Let's get uh, Stunty Bite in from the rear. That extra debuff is going to be nice. Uh, come on. Come on. Come on. A little bit faster, guys. A little bit faster. There we go. Alright. Come on. Give me a good hit. Oh, yeah. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Yes. <laughs> Alright, can't can't do that for too long here. Need to keep these guys at bay. Range fire still coming in. Alright, alright, alright. Pull these guys in. Let's pull these guys down here, actually. Come on. Let's get uh, Stunty Beta back up there. Let's get Stunty Beta over here, actually. Oh, there we go. Excellent. Alright, you guys aren't getting away that easy. You guys are not getting away that easy. Oof. A lot of dead bodies there. A lot of dead bodies. There we go, they flee. Clan Angrund flees, as they rightfully should. You know what, this is... I'm not going to be able to catch too many of them. Uh, I should be able to chase them in my next turn and cap them off, so we'll just do that, I think. Oof. For a second there, for for a full second there, I thought that might go very far south, but uh, close victory. All right, I'll take it. I'll take it. It's a big fight. Again, it's uh, the quality of the troops were pretty good, and I did get caught a little off guard. I'll be honest; I was expecting them to go for a full deployment on top of that hill, but we're okay. Didn't lose all that many, all things considered. Just under. Just under half. Uh, we can eat them. Doesn't help my other armies, so is there really a point? 983. I could use the money I am recruiting right now. Yeah, we did a lot of damage there, so that works great for me. Actually, no, I don't want to reduce the fightiness. Let's take the leadership advantage. Run! Flee. Back up. What are you doing here? What do you want? Alright. 
I just start to an episode. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, I'll take it. I don't want to deal with any of this conflict up here just yet. So if they're offering me peace treaties, I'm happy to give them give them away. What do these guys want? Bandits. Excellent. Swindla. Oh, thank you for the explanation, by the way, because I'm a bit wee, a little bit woo, whatever the hell that <laughs> clip was. I finally get it. What? No, Nubzub, you just did so well. Death Pass, Rebellion, Crooked Moon, Wah, excellent. A lot of raiding going on. Of my own accord. Where is... I, I guess Huglug is going to replace him. Let's see, who else have we got? Choleric, plus it a melee attack, but that increases the price. Or... Charismatic. Let's go with Charismatic. Hug Lug. What a beautiful name. He just wants a hug. What? Look at this guy. He just wants a hug. Charismatic. Damn right. Alright. Um, sorry. Back on topic here. We're gonna chase down these guys. Kill them all. Rather sorry. Messed up the quote there. Wipe them out. All of them is what I was going for. Uh, let's slaughter captives. Get that little boost. Belgrun Firskir. Our enemy belonging to Clan Angrund has perished in the Battle of Matorka. E Border Princess is not the nicest sounding province. Oh, that's good. Idol Kava. These idols are Gawk and Mok that appear around greenskin camps. Someone has to carve them. Damn right. It's hard work, man. I'm sure it is. It's great stuff. I I carved a uh, I carved a jack o' lantern that looks like a orc um <laughs> orc I guess symbol whatever you want to call it put it up on uh, the twitters you guys want to check it out all right let's see scar snake we got you dripping tips the gabos has a little bit more to go let us do so one more up there and then we can get savages it'll be good. Or get back here. Four, I'll go one, two, three. Yeah, so I'll get savages and then we'll get get back here. And that will uh, be very helpful. Now, let's see. I could start hunting some of these guys up. Let's get you back into Barakvar. Let's get some of that replenishment happening. But let's actually get... I'm going to let Derustif uh, recuperate properly. These guys... What's your XP at? The wrong unit selected there with these guys. Uh, more or less similar. Alright, alright. These guys, also more or less similar. Okay. Merge these guys. And so let's merge them. Okay, I wanted to create some slots for, uh, for some more nasty skulkers. Or possibly... Just some higher tier units, really. Oh, excellent, right... They didn't take Varenka Hills, so I've got myself a uh, Wolf Den, I believe. Yeah, Wolf Den. Excellent. That actually works out much better. Let's get ourselves some Goblin Wolf Riders. I like a good plan. Beauty. I love a good plan, Skarsnick. Let's quit the rating on these guys. Right, they're recruiting. So be it. A little bit of rating never hurt anybody. Gotta keep the fightiness up here. Maybe I send them in nice and early. What can I recruit here? If I get some of these nasty skulkers going. A decent army there. This is a decent army. It can't hold off this situation on its own, though. Alright, alright. What can we upgrade here? It's not a bad idea. 3,000... Not a bad idea. I want to make sure I hold uh, Karagdron as well as possible because it's got this fighting pit that helps me get some decent upgrades across the board. So I'll do that. Um, let's see. No, I was wondering if I wanted to send the Wa army out there, but I don't think so. Maybe a turn of being calm isn't too bad. What's our fighting is that? Yeah, we should be fine. We should be fine. Alright. 
Sorry. See if this guy's got anything he can do. He's tired. Poor buddy's tired. Yeah, let's uh, let's call it there. Okay. <laughs> right, because they're still chasing the target. Mm. I'll hunt them down this turn. This is the second time in as many episodes that I've forgotten to chase down a uh, <laughs> an army. Make it bigger. It is time to expand your realms. Mork demands it. Take another region off the stunties. Make them scrawl another wrong in their petty little book. Karaza Karak. In four turns. I could do that. Can't initiate combat if I do that. Hmm. Maybe we leave them be. Or actually, wait, no, I did chase them. This is a different army, I guess. Okay, Throny Finson. Now let's just leave them be. Let's just leave them be. This situation, though. We could put them under siege. I'm well nasty. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, we'll put them under siege, and if they decide to sally forth, we might just, uh, retreat. Oh, what's this? I'm gonna auto-resolve this. Why would they do that? They're intercepting me. I mean, I guess he- we've seen- we've seen- have we seen Throny before? They can pull a lot off with just single lords. Ought to resolve this though. Decisive victory. Lost more than I'd like. But a little bit of eating will fix that. Throny Ulek. Alright, another swindler. And a Dawnstone. Physical resistance 15%. Excellent. Nashrak, you've done well. Let's see. What shall we give you? Pop you on a war boar. Uh, death from below. Oh, I love these. Let us see, let us see, let us see. Let's get you a war bar. And now... Yeah, let's, uh, let's pursue our siege. Oof. Continue siege. Let's make sure the Wa has the target before we uh, cack this up, to put it in the politest terms. Alright, alright. Now, I get myself into a march and start moving towards Karazakarak as well. And let's get these guys into Barakvar. And let's recruit a couple of these and a couple of these. My concern is, will I be able to hold this off with my current situation? Possibly? Possibly? We'll find out. Oh, is he still exhausted? I forget. No, he's not anymore. Alright. I could assassinate Nash Beardtaker, or I could block the army. Or I could get rid of this guy. What is he up to? Okay. I guess I can't assassinate him. <laughs> 9% chance. You know what? Let's uh, let's kill these guys. They're the mutinous gits. I feel like that's more uh, that's more Scarsnick's style. Ah, oh, come on, the gob in the north. What are you doing, man? Need you to cause some hurt. Even with the assassin bumped up all the way. Okay. No problem. No problem. All right. Let's see what we can do here. Oh yeah, might as well get some, uh, some equipment going. Continue the siege. Pretty interesting if we actually get Karaza Karak by the end of this session. Let's try it. It's no eight peaks, but but it's something. That's for sure. What are these boys? What do they want? I feel like I'm gonna lose Barakvar pretty readily, actually. 
What's going on here? These guys, bloody spears. Nah, I think they've got... Huh. Yeah, they've got a commander, which is a problem, and it's also... It's not magic, he's melee. Nah, I'm gonna auto-resolve this, I don't think we stand a chance. Mount Squighorn. I might have to pull Nashrak back in, uh, and take Mount Squighorn. Valiant defeat, they put up a fight. Yep, yep, yep. Storm clouds gathered in the north. See, I wish this was written like the Greenskins. I'd more than happily read this if it was written in uh, green skin talk, or green talk, whatever it's called. All right, all right, it's fine. Decisive victory, beautiful, beautiful, not so beautiful actually. All right, quite a bit going on. Let's get you some. I'm trying to balance this army out a little bit. Nah. I think from that pool. Okay, next turn we can get maybe a fighting uh, pit. I believe it's called. Something a bit more substantial to get proper recruitment going on here. Meanwhile, over here... What's our situation now? Alright, slowly nudging. Slowly nudging. Continue the siege. We're gonna get uh, Skarsnik up in here as well. Alright, now we've got it. I don't think they'll sally forth, and even if they do, we should be able to hold them back. This is actually more my concern, because... Actually, that should be fine. What do you want? This guy's getting a little too close. As clogged. I'll stop them. Man, the dice gods are not in my favor not today. Likely. Just not in my favor at all. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Okay, we're losing Barakvar. Speak your words and I'll decide if you live or... Karakiran? Peace treaty and money? You know? Yeah, why not? Sure, for now. Again, don't really want to deal with this right now. I'm sort of starting to create my foothold. Oh, this is becoming a problem. This is becoming a problem. A lot faster than I thought it would. What do you want? The boys are pleased. Ooh. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna have to fight this, I think. Going to have to fight this one. careful about these guys because they can stay hidden but I'll have to circle around all right we're gonna have to fight this let's see if we can hold Varenka Hills from these mutinous gits all right Ruglash Tief Raba is in charge here let's see what uh, what we can do let's see what we can do um, don't necessarily want a full rear approach because it'll take some time to get there Instead, I want to pull us around from just further up front and try and force the engagement somewhere here. Uh, let's see, I've got a bit of a hill. Sure, let's, uh, let's station ourselves up here. I mean, it's not much of a hill, but it'll give us some more time to keep them under ranged fire. Oh, it's the, it's the big ones. I'm a touch faster than them. Might be able to pull it off. Not faster than Beard Taker. Okay, we'll see. We'll see what we can pull off here. I'm hoping to. Uh, I'm hoping to draw them in, and as they're coming in, just trickle fire into them, pull back, and then maybe push in, and then have these guys come in. That's that's the thinking right now. Oh, it's too bad that these guys are uh, commanders. It's okay. When we all pile in the. Should all help. All right, let's see how we can do. Let's pull these guys up the side just to get a full scout in. Let's move forward. Let's actually box up so I can get uh, 
rotation working just fine if I needed to. Who's left? You guys? I hate how the right click and drag work sometimes. Alright, so this is our situation right now. These guys we can hit. I have to be careful. I need to keep an eye on uh, on our situations here. Whoa! They got really close. Value of that stock ability. Moved up too close. Now I'm not going to be able to uh, take advantage of exactly what I wanted. Alright, alright. Actually, let's get it on these big guns here. See what we can do. Pull these guys back. Let's try to keep them alive here. Need to get these range units taken care of. Get these guys as well. Alright. Okay. Alright. This should actually be fine. I've got this little uh, rear fire going on here. These guys are being chased off. It's dark. It's dark here. Let's pull out, get another charge into these guys, these night goblins perhaps. These guys are going to give up pretty quick. All that range fire. They don't want to put up with it. Damn nasty skulkers. Alright, open fire on the skulkers. Pull these guys back in, get that rear charge. All right, yeah, we're fine. Damn mutinous gits, what are they thinking? Scar Snake's back, baby. All right, they're off. Let's hit these guys up. Let's get a rear charge in as well. Not caring so much about this guy, because I, I can take care of him afterwards if necessary. Let's open fire, excellent. Rain death down upon them. It's too dark to see much. Well, we can see the blood splatters, and we can see the symbol that says victory is in our grasp. Excellent. 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 Alright. Just a little bit of cleanup here. I don't want these guys coming back, and I can't chase them because I don't have an army nearby. So I just want to hit them hard enough that it'll take them some time before they can come back. I love seeing the wolves uh, chase people down. They're so fast, even at normal speed, if somebody points that out. <laughs> Alright, so they're taken care of. These guys are taken care of. Yeah, let's call it here. Good enough. Excellent decisive victory, and I was worried about that. Only lost 307. I don't know. I feel like that went well. Lost 901. They lost. Decisive victory. Let us feast. Yeah, let's feast. Meat's back on the menu, boys. Yeah, run away. Oh, boy. Okay. Karagdron, this one's an important one. Can I fend this off? They've got two trolls, they've got some artillery as well. Uh, let's see. Yeah, let's try it. Let's go for it.
Yeah, they definitely have a bit of an advantage in this one, but if we can, uh, again, just isolate and pick them off one at a time. These troll, uh, so much low leadership here. Okay. Want to get the Wolf Riders. I have to be careful about the uh, Orc Boar Boys. Alright. Cut off the Doom Diver Catapults nice and early. They will falter very quickly. And then I can cut some of these range units out. Sword Infantry, okay. Okay. How many of you guys have looms? Just the one? These two. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. So let's tuck these guys off to the side. That's going to be a problem, so let's split them up. Pull them back so they don't get spotted on the march in. Let's get these guys wide and thin. And let's get the range contingent. I need to focus down on these uh, trolls as soon as possible. Need to absolutely focus down on the trolls as they come in, and then I can change my mind to, for example, the black orcs. All right, this could be pretty bad. All right, let's see how it goes. Need to get the trolls in as well. Going to keep them at a safe distance, hopefully, and then charge them through the lines into whatever comes here. I'm hoping the black orcs hit here so I can hit them with the trolls. Sounds like a plan. Sounds like a plan. Let's get one unit over here, just in case. Let's go. All right. All right, those have been spotted. That's okay. Pull these guys away from those uh, war boy biggins. Have to pull these guys away. Oh man. In. This is not going to go well. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's dive in here, let's get to those. No, actually, let's get these uh, black orcs nice and early. Let's try to at least. Come on. back in. Let's try and get these range guys to stop firing on me. These guys ran off, eh? Alright. Okay, so the trolls are giving up, which is good. Let's try and get these guys to give up as well. Come on. I need these guys to hold fast. I absolutely need them to hold fast. Their willingness to surrender is going to be the end of me. Oh, can we sneak through? Come on, I need to sneak through. Keep going. Keep going. Alright, alright, alright. Let's pull these guys back here. Okay. Okay. We're in an alright position right now. Let's keep these trolls here. They are winning still. Let's put the trolls into the goblins just to try and break the army a little bit faster. Alright, these guys need to be pulled back because they're currently engaged with their lord. Come on, dive in there. And you guys hold the black orcs in place. Fire there, pull these guys back down, get some poison going. Actually, let's pull these guys out of here. Um, okay. Alright, alright. 
Okay, open fire on the Black Orcs. Let's try to scare them off. Let's get these guys back in here. Get a full surround on these Orcs. Let's get these guys to dive in there because they will be helpful. Just trying to split the ranged up. I think it was a little too late there. It's okay. These guys are going to dive in. But I've got the Black Orcs nearly breaking. Continue some of that fire. Come on, you guys. Dive in there. Keep that fire going. Send these guys in there. Pull these guys back. Come on. I need you to run faster. Open fire on them. Let's scare them off. Okay, okay, okay. We're good. All right, cool. This should be fine. Black Orcs are leaving? Excellent. Alright, let's get into Crusher Wolf Herder. Not gonna be hurting any more wolf anytime soon, buddy. Not when I'm through with you. Alright, 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 alright. Alright, alright. Come on. Come on, drop these guys. Oh, not like that. Yes! Black Orcs are on the run. Okay. Let's pull around to these guys. Actually, yeah. Keep the chase with them. This guy's on the run as well. Come on, open fire on them. Okay. We're gonna get a full surround on these cavalry units as well, so that'll be great. Losing a couple of goblins there, but that's okay. Excellent. That's right, it's a victory. It's just, uh... <laughs> okay. Alright, alright. Don't need to hit them too hard. I can't really chase them with much. I don't have much to, to chase with. So let's end it there. Close victory, but that's okay. I'm just glad I could hold it. Because, again, this is an important city for me. Uh, I didn't want to lose it even for one turn. I don't want the buildings to end up damaged and then have to reconstruct them back up. So I'm glad I could hold them back. Wow, these guys did a lot of work. 112 kills. Excellent. Their black orcs were monstrous. As can be expected. Oof. Alright. Time to eat. That's delicious. Wow, the beastmen have been taken care of. Alright. Aw. Oh, man, Nashrak. I liked him too. A lot of rebellions going on. Okay. So, we're not going to get an orc. We're not going to self-recruit an orc. Let us instead get... Not giving me any options here. <laughs> Choppa Envy. I didn't realize he had that. I guess we're going to get a shaman. Oh, these aren't... I mean, there's definitely a funny factor here with the maimed leg. Plus the leadership. You know what? Night Goblin War Boss. He's got a maimed leg. Let's give him a good name for that. Argor. Let's rename him. Remember, he's got a broken leg. Drop in the comments whatever you think a good name for, for a dwarf with a maimed leg is. Alright, these guys. Oh, they completely destroyed the drops. <laughs> That's good. Oh, that's good, that's good. Alright. Gotta take Mount Squighorn back. Have to fend these guys off. Hmm. We can get set on our way back. Again, we're losing Barakvar. Pretty sure we are. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Not a chance. One of these battles is gonna take me. So we're going to get out of here. You have to know when you can fight and when you can't fight. And that is definitely a situation where I cannot fight. Question is, do I want to keep this siege going? Or do I want to pull back and destroy the bloody spears before they become a bigger problem? Alright. Which of my armies is actually the one leading the siege here? Huh. It's a huge advantage. I'm wondering if I send my Wa army to take care of something else. 
Let's see. Warm is really good though. I could instead send uh, Argor's army here. It's a you know it's a mid tier army more or less. But he's the one who's actually sieging. Man, decisions, decisions. Decisions, decisions. Okay, if we lose the Pillars of Grungli, that's fine, I'll take it later. I want to make sure I can get Karaza Karak. I feel like that's an important goal. I've got uh, I've got Huglug's army here coming in to fend Crusher Wolfherda off. He's not able to replenish, so I can... Uh, I feel like I can intercept him on his way out this way, or if he hits Karagron again. Garrison is hurt, but I should be able to fend him off again. We might lose Mount Squighorn. We're probably losing Mount Gunbad. Because that's a full-fledged army. But it's okay. Again, like I'm I'm as much as I hate it, right now my important territories, in my opinion, are uh, the Blood River Valley and the Death Pass. I'm okay with losing what is this? Rib Peaks? and the Silver Road. I'd like to keep the Silver Road. So that's the thought, that's the that's the thinking, the thought. We're gonna try and hold, sorry, not Blood River Valley, we're gonna try and hold half of Blood River Valley, Death Pass, we're gonna take back the Silver Road. Yeah, kind of maintain this strip and then push down to home. So, right now I'm thinking the siege on Karaz Akara continues so we can conquer that territory. And then we'll just have to work our way through the uh, the Bloody Spears again. I don't understand why they would uh, hate me so much. I thought we had an agreement. They confederated. It's free will. Sort of. Sort of. Alright, well that was an action-filled session, if there ever was one. So I'm actually going to call it right there. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, I think we're in a bit of an interesting situation. It's a little stagnated here, which I'm not happy about. A little stagnated, but once we take Karaza Karak, I'm going to make my path down. Pillars of Grugni, Mount Squighorn. Hopefully we get to keep Karak drawn. And uh, I think we make our way back to um, Karak Eight Peaks. This uh, little detour has taken longer than I was expecting. But I think it's been necessary. I think it's been necessary. In fact... Yeah, I think that's the plan. So we're going to try and take Karaz Akarak early in the next session. Then we're going to push down this path here and then maybe go into war with uh, with the Greenskins and then finally end up at, uh, well, at home. That's the plan. So. Hopefully you guys had a good time. As always, if you did enjoy, please drop a like and a comment. It lets me know you guys are interested and keeps me going with uh, these kinds of sessions. And just to let you know, the vote from the last episode of Skarsnik is more or less in, I would say. It sounds like we're doing every 10th episode live, which I think would be a nice balance. We've got a lot of VODs, and then every once in a while we could make an event of it, whoever can show up. And I'll try to keep in mind all the uh, feedback I got about the live streams to keep it friendly for everyone watching the archive. Nonetheless, as I said, if you had a good time, please drop a comment and a like, let me know. And of course, if you do have a name for our little maimed general here, Argor, with the uh, with the maimed leg, let's give him a nice name. Let's give him a respectable name, and hopefully he leads the army to some greatness. Again, I must have said again like 10 times in the last 10 seconds. Thank you guys very much for joining me. It's always an absolute treat, and I'll catch you next time. Cheers.